Laboratory analysis is a practice that has not always been associated with farming. After all, the practice of planting and harvesting crops has certainly been in existence long before modern scientific methods came to be. We are in a knowledge economy, and uh, knowledge is the basis of, of uh, agricultural commerce, and, and uh, the scientific information provided uh, by soil analysis to farmers and, and ranchers and other clients across, uh, across the spectrum of agriculture provide the competitive edge for, for them as they, as they make extremely important decisions about the allocation of resources for fertilizer, for uh, seed population, and uh, other agronomic decisions that they make. Scientific analysis has come to be an integral part of agriculture. It is a fact Proper treatment of soil has a dramatic impact on crop yields. First of all, you can't manage what you don't measure. And there are so many undefined factors in farming, such as the weather and the market that change daily, that why not know one of your factors and base your decisions on one of the factors that you do know, such as the nutrients in your soil so you know how much fertilizer to spread, saving you money throughout the year. In order to maintain healthy crops, professionals in the agriculture community use the term soil nutrition. So when we think of soil nutrition, we like to think of it as soil fertility. So when we talk about soils being fertile, we first off like to think of the nutrients it has, so like N and P and K, which are nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium, the minerals, the microorganisms that are like living in the soil, and lastly, soils tend to be slightly acidic. And that's like what we test for here. Without the right amount of nutrients, it's impossible to grow a healthy plant. It's like trying to drive a car without any oil in it. You're definitely going to damage it. You're for certain not going to win in your races, and you might even kill it. In order to learn more about soil nutrition, American Farmer is on location in Sioux Falls, South Dakota. Sioux Falls is home to AgLab Express. AgLab Express is a testing laboratory. Uh, we do analysis of soils, uh, plant tissue, and manure. We're really good at what we do. We're just one part of the, the precision uh, agriculture industry. Mike Barber, the founder of AgLab Express, brings a unique perspective to the field of soil analysis, having recently retired from a career as an orthotist. I was looking for something where I could, uh, could work more with the family, but we didn't have enough land. Uh, as a family for all of us to farm together. This just happened to come up to be the natural solution. South Dakota State University up in Brookings uh, recently closed down their soil testing laboratory to the public and that left uh, a void or an opportunity uh, in this field and uh, we jumped on it. We decided it would be a good thing um, to do and, and it has turned out to be a, a great thing to do. The Barbers now operate both a family farm and a soil research lab. The laboratory provides complete soil, plant, and manure analysis for the agriculture community. The process of scientifically analyzing soil as a tool for farming has quickly become widely accepted as a vital part of agriculture. What we're looking at now is uh, um, soils shaking in an orbital oscillator uh, with an extracting solution. We're going to pull that off and uh, filter uh, the solution uh, through this apparatus which we engineered Essentially, this is a way to uh, filter the soils back, let the clear solution with the suspended nutrients uh, into a test tube rack. Um, so this is just uh, one of the ways that we speed things up. AgLab works daily to educate farmers on the importance of taking a proper sample and maintaining a sample's identity throughout the process of analysis. Main things for grid sampling, precision egg soil sampling is GPS, which is much needed for anything so you can go back and record your sample points in the field, run an accurate boundary for tillable acres, and also a computer that's going to be able to read and save your data. And you want to take 10 to 12 good quality cores, 6 inch cores, where your depth is very important because you go too deep, it's going to throw off your nutrient levels. If you go too high, it's going to make them higher. You want to be sure that you're not sampling too much acreage. Uh, we only like to get around 50 acres per sample. You can do smaller than that if you want to do more precision uh, agricultural management. The other thing to keep in mind is that you want to be sure that you're getting a random sample from the field itself. Whether you decide to go out at an arc pattern or if you want to go in with a W or an M, depending on which side you like to come at it. For the barbers, the proof is in the results. 
By planting and applying fertilizer at variable rates, the impact of AgLab soil analysis is crystal clear. Most farmers work with an agronomist to help analyze and apply the results of AgLab's work. Eastern Farmers Cooperative, we actually take the results from the lab. We've got a computer program set up and software and we pull those results into the computer program. And we've got equations set up that basically are gonna tell us, okay, um, we've got this lab analysis for a nutrient, and then this is our yield goal, and this is how much of that nutrient we want to apply to each different area out in that field. Kind of the, the neat thing about this is, is, you know, for the farmer, we're going to put the nutrients where the crop needs it to try to maximize yield. Farmers nationwide are currently being faced with choices that will affect not only the entire country, but the future of the environment. Mike Barber hopes that the work he is doing today will help ensure that his children will inherit a sustainable world. Uh, most farmers are concerned with sustainable agriculture and our, our role in that is to uh, provide the data to allow the, uh, the grower to be informed um, so that they uh, can manage their inputs correctly. Here in the lab and in most farming operations and in most operations of any kind um, around the world, uh, you get more with less uh, by optimizing efficiency. As soon as the combines are done and the, the crop is out, uh, the farmer wants to be in there uh, fertilizing. Uh, we get samples, we can turn them around in a day or two. Uh, it really expedites the whole process and everybody feels a whole lot better. For more information, visit www.aglabexpress.com or call 605-271-9237.